Good morning children. Welcome to standard 3. Today I am going to teach you active English workbook. And this is your active English workbook. Today we shall see the use of shall and or in making questions. So when do we use shall? We use shall in questions that offer or suggest something. We usually start the question with shall I or shall we. To understand this, we shall see an example. Go by train, go by bus. Here you have two options or two offers. You can go by train or you can go by bus. So the question here will be formed as shall we go by train or shall we go by bus? Moving on to the next topic. Here we shall see the use of same as and different from. When do we use same as? We use same as when there is a similarity. And when we use and when do we use different from? We use different from when there is a difference. To understand this, here is an example. You can see Different shapes numbered differently. For example, number 1 is the same as number 3. The shape of number 1 is same as number 3 because there is a similarity of the shape. But number 2 is different from number 1 because the shape of number 2 is entirely different from shape of number 1. The next topic we are going to see is changing sentences using may. Changing sentences using may. When do we use may? We use may when there is a possibility to take permission or when you have a wish. When there is a possibility to take permission or when you have a wish. When a question starts with perhaps, children pay attention. When a question starts with perhaps, here perhaps means possibility. So your answer will be with yes, it, yes, it may be or no, it may not. For example, perhaps the cat is thirsty. Here there is a possibility that the cat can be thirsty or not. So your answer will be yes, it may be thirsty. So children, today we studied the use of shall and or in making a question. Same as and different from, use of same as and different from and use changing a sentence using may. Based on these, worksheets will be uploaded on your school website Kindly go through it and try to solve it. Thank you children.